Hello everyone and welcome back to Kronos Plays God of War today! Well, I'm gonna go over here and free this thing. Actually, you know what? Or that. Booyah. Climb? No. Push. We gotta be almost done, I would imagine. I don't know why that bird just doesn't come over here and give us a lift. Maybe he doesn't want us to leave. Well, we just ripped apart the part of ship. Dope. Is that Tears Temple? It is. It is time, my son. Look around at what you have done. Uh-oh. Hi, Zeus. I like the first person perspective. Atreus, look away. Daddy's having a flashback. Come on, we gotta go. You saw. There's no time. Look. Oh, we've gone past the temple. We've gone on top of the temple. Good plan! <laughs> Hi, Brock. We're home. Oh, there's a gate thing here. Oh, the humanity! Is that too soon? I feel like that's too soon. Secret chamber. <laughs> chamber of Odin. We are leaving this realm. Now. We are leaving, boy! As long as we didn't ride our way back. Oh, we're up above. Huh. Can I open this door? I can, but I want to go over here first. And be like, hey, are you a Valkyrie? Or just awesome treasure. I thought I found all these. Didn't the, didn't the thing say I found all these? Or was that something else? Maybe that was something else. What is this place? This is Odin's. I'd recognize his atrocious taste anywhere. Wait, this, this isn't the right way, right? Look at that! It's the missing panel about here. Odin must have stolen it. But why? He had a crush. He always has his reasons. Might I have a look? No. Sure. Well, this is most unexpected. Why? What does it mean? Does he have the soul eater? Isn't that unexpected? Head. Look, clearly that's tear. Traveling somehow. Perhaps magically. But what's that to do with the giants that they should devote a shrine to it? I'm afraid that is none too clear. Huh. What are those runes in the corners? Not runes. Symbols from different lands. Now we have the Omega symbol. Or... Aye. How do you... This one I know too well. Oh yeah, that was your symbol, right? Oh. His eyes. They are jewels. Like yours. No doubt signifying the gift of sight the giants granted us. Give me a closer look. Interesting. But another eye? Do you want your other eye back? Very interesting. What is that? Secret plans concealed by Tyr so none could access but him. And those few others the giants trusted. And right under Odin's nose. Ho ho ho! I did promise I'd get you to Jotunheim. What do you mean, Ed? You said we were out of options. Don't you see, brother? Odin never gave up hope, and neither should we. Yeah, but Odin's kind of like a lunatic. There was a clue in here, but we are the ones who found it. These plans are for a key to some chamber Tears kept hidden. I don't know where it's leading or what we'll find, but it's a path. So I gotta go back to the other direction. How do we make this key? I suggest we ask a dwarf. God damn it. 
Oh yeah, boy, you need to apologize to Sindri because you are a big, big old bitch That's to him. On the temple door. It's a bunch of rooms together. Peace, unity, hope, other things too. Yeah. His own design. He made this door himself. Cool. Let's uh, let's go back here. <laughs> And go through this other door that was just open and I didn't have to do anything special for because apparently it's not the right way. It's a chest. Go figure. Is this a chest? No. Grab this. I think this is where Odin brought all his best clues about Jodenheim. Huh. Cool. Well, let's grab this. It's got a crap ton of experience. Unlock new moves for the Eye of the Outer Realm. Epic enchantment bonus to all. Glad I came back. Let's go ahead and check that out real fast. Um, what's my weakest one? Well, probably the symbol of truth. You're right. Go all the way to the top. Now it's top. Is there no way to get to the top instantly? Huh. I have the other. Ooh. I'm in. Absolutely in. I hear. Oh, that's right. We're in this place. I was going to say, I hear hammering, so a dwarf needs to be nearby, or should be nearby. But yeah, Brock usually lives here. Seems like kind of sacrilege, really. And Odin would probably be mad, wouldn't he? I guess the dwarves can hide from him, so it's not that big of a deal. Maybe I wouldn't want to chance that. That's an elevator. Alrighty, down we go. Where does this elevator come from, though? Boy. Before. When you. Saw. I didn't see anything. Liars! Everyone here's a liar! Someone. An old man. What old man? Can we go? Yes. Oh, very well. That's gonna haunt him for the rest of his life. All right, let's get back to Midgard and see about making that key. Where's that dwarf? I mean, he's right out that door, but we can go back to Midgard first if you want. That's fine. Ah, oh, then I either gotta make my way back to that Valkyrie. I I was told there was another Valkyrie in Elfheim or Elfheim, whatever the hell it's called. Uh, that might be better for starting the Valkyrie fights because it might be a little bit more Marilyn, well, easier. Why did you not tell us Balder is the son of Freya? He is. It's shocking every time I hear it, and yet obviously I know it. When I think about Balder and Freya, I... the mayor? Yes, lad. Ah, uh, some Freya. spell. How's that, brother? Hey, tell me Baldur's vulnerability. Baldur is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. Wait, what is happening? He is bewitched not to speak of what he knows. Huh. I am? I am! Oh, that's it precisely. I wonder how long that's been so. Since she had my head at her mercy, or back when I figured out Baldur's weakness. I'm here. Yes, lad. You just said you figured out Baldur's weakness. Did I? <laughs> Boulder is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, <laughs> physical or magical. Enough. This means there is a way. If he troubles us again, we will find it. I think I already know it, to be quite honest. Isn't, like, when Freya freaked out about those green arrows, right? And we have a piece of it on the boy's uh, tunic, so... That seems to go hand-in-hand hand with sort of... Well, how storytelling usually goes. Is this the door? That's the door. That makes sense. But we don't have those arrows anymore. We have the tip of one. So I guess that could help. Yo, dog, what up? Can you make it? Is it a weapon? Armor? Or likewise an instrument of war, of which I'm a master at shaping. No? Then forget it. 
Even if I wanted to make such an insignificant goo -gaw, I'm liable to chink my tools working on something so delicate and ladylike. Then what is it? it? Hey, Sindri. How did well the item was scaps like? Keep the layers thin. Alternate the overlay. Okay, smart guy. And where do you propose to find a lump of quality scap slag? Last time I saw one, I could still get rigid down south. Oh, you can't get rigid down south anymore? I'm sorry. Shut your mouth. Is that... Where did you... I had to get my hands dirty. <laughs> <laughs> well, don't just stand there. Let's do this. What? Aw, oh, brotherly you, bonding. You're fine with working on something that's not a weapon? Oh, hell, why not? <laughs> what? I can grow too. <laughs> oh, watch, watch the spine. Keep your wrist loose. No, you keep your wrist loose. Yeah, I need more heat here. Coming up. You gonna temper that steel longer? You don't need to. I triple quenched it with Drago oil. See, how inventive. Drago oil? Dragos have oil? You clever little beaver. Never too late to learn a new trick, is it? <laughs> nah, I've been learning them all throughout this game. Here it is. Nope. Don't forget this. Why is that one already lit? Did you just ruin it? No, oh, quit your grinning. It's downright unsettling. It's just nice to see you together. But now the rune on your brand looks different. Yeah, price of uh, reforging something what broke. I knew it. You two love each other. Oh, cut it out, Francis. You're gonna get me all weak. <laughs> I like the new one better. Don't you? Real hey, boy. You. Apologize to Sinri. Shake his hand. Do it. <laughs> Alright, I need to upgrade my like my blades though first. Let's do it. Uh ooh, there's a lot of stuff here. Blades of Chaos. We get craft. We can get all this stuff. Uh, I don't know what that oh it's Niflheim stuff. Okay. Get this stuff, which is not good for me. And this is just the other parts of those. Alright. Get that out. We can upgrade these. I'm not going to do that. Enchantments. Oh, we can buy this. And that. But I don't want any of that. Uh, Blitz Chaos. And go. Alrighty. Are looking a lot better every time. So next one gets to 50. I'm guessing it doesn't give us a. It's almost close to the amount of we can get for the 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 axe, but still, frozen flame, chaos blade. Oh god damn it! I'm gonna have to go to Muselheim. I really actually don't want to do that. <laughs> Those challenges. Well, All right. Locate. Tears mysterious door. All right, but first, let's go to Alfheim. Wait, no, can he? Sorry. What was that? Oh, it's a quest. What do you want? With the whetstone and hammer you've retrieved for us, Brog and I can construct the Devagrathiker, dwarven armor of legend. We just need three more mythical ingredients before we set to hammering. Which are? Don't know. Armor's pure legend. And the details is fuzzier than a wolver's butthole. Do you expect us to find parts from a legend? Oh, Mozart near the dwarf king found two of them. Everyone knows that. Okay. He went looking for the third. Poof, he vanished. Maybe he'll find some clues at his stronghold in Konungsgard. And looky here. A Konungsgard entry stone. Shocking. It's got your name on it. How fucking strange. <laughs> All right, fine. We'll uh, hail to the king, baby. We'll go ahead and do this one then. Uh, to be fair, large stone structure. I feel like if we go outside that door, we're gonna advance the quest. 
maybe. I'm sure it'll be fine. Um, also pretty sure there's like a post game, so even if I do do that, You'll know it whatever. It. And no, it's a little ways away. We just we can just go down south. Now we just need to figure out what door this key opens. It has to be somewhere around the temple. Oh, that's what we're looking for, a door? No, we're looking for a boat. I'm on a boat, bitch. We gotta go to the south tower, he was saying? Down there. And then the brazers, and there's the last cipher for Niflheim, oh, which... You're right. Now that we got the key, we can open that big door anytime we want. Let's explore. Hear what I was saying. Uh... What was I saying? Oh my god, what was I saying? My brain just I mean, like, <clears throat> excuse me, was I just like, turned off. There was an incident shortly after the forging of Mjolnir. When Mjolnir. A Dragon! Meeting between Odin and the giant kings. Well, this was when the long war was young, when victory was still a thing dreamed of, and the Jotnar might have tipped the balance between Aesir and Vanir. Odin had persuaded Tyr that the hammer was merely a deterrent, a means to broker peace from a position of strength. Tyr was hopeful to convince all parties they would prosper best through peace. He knew the giants were deeply concerned about the hammer, a super weapon in hands they did not trust. But they trusted. Is this how I get up there? Tyr always believed the best in people, and taking Odin at his word in his desire for peace, he brought the Raven King to Jotunheim. Uh, from there, things unraveled quickly. The giants anticipated Odin's trickery and exposed his true agenda to spy and steal their secret wisdom. With magic, they expelled Odin from their realm and cursed him never to return. Frustrated, Odin visited his fury upon the giants of Midgard. Thor unleashed Mjolnir's might upon any giant he could find. None could stand against the tide of slaughter that followed. And at last, it seems, with Tyr's aid, they retreated. The tower disappeared. No giants could be found in Midgard. Understandable. No I would have left too. Your god has set foot in Jotunheim since. Okay, but like, crap. How do I get up there? I want to get up to that dragon. Maybe that's how I get a uh, another dragon tier. We land. Okay, we land here, right? And then we go around. We could probably fight that thing too. I don't know if it's dead. I don't know how it would have died. How do you think it could have died? I mean, I I stabbed it in the wing. Maybe it would probably stab an artery, so maybe it bled to death. It could have crashed and died, but it's a dragon, so I'd imagine it's gonna need a little more than that to uh, to die. Maybe. And then we'll go do Hail the King. We were on a way to do it, but... Hi. Is this a dragon tear? Is it a treasure? Dragon tear. Dope. Thank you very much. We need one more of those. And then I can upgrade the Affinity Gauntlet one more time. Any others around here? Just checking. Okay, down we go. And then south we go. Nice jump. That actually looked really weird. I'm glad Brock and Sindri were able to work out their differences. Now they are twice as irritating. Aww. Aww. I think it's nice to see them trust each other again. And besides, they're going to make us some powerful armor, probably. So that'll come in handy. They should probably do it for free. In there. Oh, okay, we've been in here before because I got that dew drop thingy. Yeah, we apparently didn't come too far in here, though. King's Hollow. Told us what Magni and Modi had to do with Prime. Oh, yes. I mean, well, neither of them have anything to do with him now, aren't they dead? Thor was that nobody in the court could get the stone body off of him. 
Thor was no use at this point, his brain rattled, his breath shallow, but none of Odin's men were nearly strong enough to help. Then enter little Magni and Modi, no taller than shrubs, and while nobody but myself was looking, they flipped over Hrungnir's corpse and freed their father. Magni, being blonder, got all the credit, and ah. Modi remained bitter about it from that day to the end, which I don't need to tell you about. Well, they're dead now, so... Oh, well. Well, Modi not, might not be dead. Magni's totally dead. He put an axe in his face. No dwarves here? That's shocking. There's usually dwarves outside these areas. Okay, let's go in here and find us some treasure. There's a lot more open in here than I thought it was going to be. Kind of thought this was going to be a cave. Actually, I'm like really surprised that it's not a cave. Why isn't this a cave? Get that. Thank you very much. Pick it up. There we go. Hack silver. Not that much hack silver. That is actually a pathetic amount of hack silver compared to what I've been getting recently. But thanks, it's a thought that counts. Sure. Down we go. More treasure. Yeah, I mean, how much hack silver do I actually have now? Oh, I have a beautiful amount of hack silver and some new skills. Let's see. Only three new skills, huh? This is a stance one. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not really. I'm, I'm gonna get it just because. What else am I gonna use the experience points for? Um. Oh, on impact. Okay, cool. Okay. That's just an enhancement to the other ones. And sure. Alright, up we go. Oh, boy. I wanted to check your summons. You get the wolves still. I was told those are actually really good. Though, when I used them before, they didn't really... Uh, it might be a difficulty thing, it was also said in the comment. When I used them before, they didn't really do too, too much against, well, the Valkyrie I was using. Though, they're the most upgraded one, so... Boy. We'll try them again. It says, Glory to Motsignir, the Dwarf King. May his reign be long, prosperous, and filled with peace. Dope. Oh, there they are. Well, there's one. Hey, Sindri, what up? Greetings, and welcome to Conan's Guard. Do you have a quest, too? I just want to make sure you're good and prepared before heading in any further. There's all manner of nastiness left over from the Mad Dwarf King's foul practices. What kind of practices? Oh, various sacrificing, dark enchantments, blood, magic, and so forth. Quite common among the older dwarves, unfortunately. Old habits are hard to break. Okay, well, thanks for the heads up. I don't think we need anything. No, we don't. I see it, boy. Chain. I hope we can find the binding shrines. This place is huge. Oh, dragon! Okay. Sure. There can be dragons here. I'm all up for dragons. Get over here. No, get over here. Get over. Well, I mean, I guess get up there. Oh, Jesus. Wow, that hit you all the way over there? That seems weird. I'm game, though. All right. Uh, go ahead and grab this and just do that. What's over here? Ah, treasure. Ooh, Odinburg. Been a while since I killed one of you, it feels like. Oh, Jesus freaking Christ! But why? Okay, then just do that, then. <laughs> 
Okay. Hey, he dropped items. I'm assuming that's the treasure. Grab all the... Ooh, legendary. What, what legendary stuff did we get? That looked like an en enhancement or enchantment that I'll never get the name right for. Um, let's go all the way up. It was inscribed tres uh, crest of tenacity. Dope. Thank you. Can I reach you with this? I cannot, but I can reach you with this. Huh, halfway there. Halfway there. Ho, ho. Living on a prayer. Hey, that's the hack, Silver. I've been known to love. So there's another dragon we need to fight. Not fight, but free. And hopefully we get another dragon tier. And then my infinity gauntlet can be even more powerful. Go ahead, keep attacking. There we go. Good job. I don't think there's anything around here. He's dead. Sweet. Did not mean to do that. Did not mean to do that. I wanted that. This leads down. More than one dragon. He must have needed them to create this legendary armor. Interesting thought, lad. Oh no, really? Nearly everything about dragons is useful and contains power. Teeth, scales, even excrement. That guy's just going on a walk, excrement? apparently. Yeah, uh, shit. Dragon shit is powerful. <laughs> I lad, potently powerful. <laughs> <laughs> Ned is having fun with you. Oh, I I knew that. <laughs> Uh, we have fun here. Okay, you, I don't know why you just passed up the boy and didn't aggro to us, but thanks. So I think I saw a shrine over there. I think anyways, like, might not be accurate. Nothing? Isn't that a shrine? It's a keystone. There's a warp point. That will come in handy. Well, we just gotta clear out the warp point. I like how level fives are now green to us. Sure, it's like enemies we've been fighting the entire game, but at the same time, they can be kind of hard sometimes. Sometimes. Not these guys. These guys are easy. I was about to say, like, what? Where's your health bar? So we need to get up there somehow. Looks like we gotta go around. Now, dragon, do not start spewing lightning fire at us. Please. Wait, oh, he's dead. Oh, there's a guy up there. Uh, is he dead? He's dead. Hello. Ow! Well, now would be great. He's alive. That's a shame. Um... Boy, can I just give you like a five fingers and just throw you up there? That seems like an appropriate thing to do to get you, I don't know, us some treasure. I don't know how my axe came from all the way over there. And so we like, we weren't even over there, I think. I see him. That's an impressive front door. That's yeah, pretty dope. These materials must be pretty special to make the legendary armor. This legendary armor better be worth the trouble. We need but three of those. But if Sindri make it together, I'm sure it's worth the effort. Don't you trust them at least? I trust you, Atreus. I do not trust the legend. Oh. Ah. That's so nice. But also, that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press like below. If you're not subscribed yet, why don't you head to my video section, check out some of the content, and see if it's to your liking. Once again, thank you for watching. I hope you all have a great day.